Hey there, true believers, Rain Kisaragi with more Let's Play the Eternity Odyssey Project. The last time we got down to, I forget what floor, 18 or not, 18, we got down, actually we touched 19, didn't we? We did touch 19, and then I decided to puss out because I was too weak. Anyway, I upgraded some equipment, um, I got the moon, uh, the moon aspis, and, uh, Kira has, uh, has, uh, has a Jazzerant, because that's really good armor. So I was like, you should probably have that. Uh, the Moon Aspis is actually one of the best shields in the game. And I happened to get it by killing those, um, uh, those mantises? Mantid? Mantids? It's the plural of mantis. The plural of mantis, those ones, that are on this floor. Because, uh, if you kill them in one turn, and it was one turn, not one attack. I thought it was one attack, but no, just one turn, you have a whole turn. Um, you get their, um, I think it's the silver eyes you get from them. And, uh, with that you get three of those and you can sell them to make the, uh, make the, uh, make the moon aspis. So, I got those, uh, Kira and Ko have those because they're really, really good. Uh, and otherwise I don't think I have any, I have any upgrades. Um, some people got swords, but I think the swords were last time. So I don't think I need to talk about swords, because we got swords and we got better uh, bows, and Sahony got nothing since he uses a stick. So, oh, actually, I can cut out a lot of this, can't, not not a lot of this, but a little bit. Mm. Alright, well, I can cut a little bit of it out. It's a little less wandering around. Um, hmm. Let's try to run. Let's actually do something out of character and try to run away. Thank you, Kira. See, because I want to I want to enter that section uh, where it said, "Oh, there's things around." Uh, I want to enter that bit with as much health and uh, TP as humanly possible. So, it's just going to be safer if I have um, if I don't even get into combat. <laughs> this I had to kill this thing in one turn. That's 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 the thing. That. They weren't hard. I, I I actually developed a little bit of a little bit of, a little bit of a formula to do it. It was more tedious than anything. It wasn't hard. It was just something that I wish I didn't have to do anymore. Well, let's finish mapping this out. I'm recording in a, in a different spot today too, so pardon if my map drawings are off. Um, you may already know why I had uh, why I'm in a different spot. You may already know. I don't know when I'm recording that video, but I'm gonna probably try to do it. I think I just map out these little pillars that I can't go in. There, that's fine. I'm just gonna draw like a drunk person. That's as far as this is gonna go. It's gonna be. There. And uh, if I haven't uploaded the video explaining why I am I'm recording in a new spot yet, bear blah blah blah. Whenever we're just gonna push through because we need to. I will explain uh, next. Well, eventually I will explain. Um, don't want to use up all this TP, but I really don't have much of a choice, do I? Yeah, I really don't want to burn through TP, but this is acceptable, I suppose. Huh, ink stick. That's new. Yes, it is. Aha! I didn't just forget about it like usual. It actually was new. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't remember if I said I would. If I, if I said I was going to grind or not between sets. I don't remember, but I didn't. Aha! So, except for against the mantises, mantids, whatever. Anyway, uh, these pixies are important for a quest. We're going to ignore them because the quest is kind of stupid. I'll do it on my own time, but basically we need to be we need to be petrified by them, and it's stupid. Oh, I do have a skill point. Uh, we need we need to be up, 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 up petrified by them, and it's kind of dumb. We're gonna raise Kira's that. Ko is going to get a shield smite. I feel that's gonna be helpful. Me, um, I don't know. Um, a pull on, I suppose. This is a stun raid on a pull on. Sweet. I didn't know that. I'm just going to go ahead and get a TP up, and Todd... Uh, that one. Because it nulls two buffs. Aha, good. There, I forgot that I leveled up. 
There. I leveled up, leveled up one time, and we just did it now. So there we go. I grinded out one level by fighting Mantis. But yes, uh, we need to, we need to be uh, we need to be uh, to, uh, to, uh, to be uh, uh, to be petrified by these pixies. And then we go back to the apothecary, and he says, "Oh, you're petrified. I'll I know how to fix that." And then you finish the quest. It's kind of dumb. We'll we'll get there. We'll do. I'll. I'll get petrified off screen and then we'll bother with that later. Until then, we have to try to figure out how the hell to get through here again, because I didn't map where I was supposed to go, because I am a cretin. This one just takes me to there, and that's not helpful. Since we do need to get these red beaks, I'm actually going to fight them. Yes. I, I, I'm actually going to fight these because I need a lot of bits off of these things. I don't like that they have, so, they have so much health still. There, yeah, that'll work. Good. Got nothing. Good. And I don't think this way is gonna be uh, as helpful as I want it to be. So I th think we actually do have to go this way. Because then we go this way. And then it's... Oh, this way doesn't seem to be right, but... No. No, it isn't right. Damn it! Alright. I'm gonna go uh, get a map for this floor, I think. Sounds like probably a good idea, so... I'll be back in a minute when I have a map! Because I should have done that. So, one minute, everybody. And we're back, sorry about that. I've mapped out everything, and there's lots of ease around the map this time, because I'm going to navigate this place with ease. It was a stupid joke. Well, well, let me have it, okay? So, I figured out kind of where I need to go, so we just need to uh, follow the path of ease, and then we can get there. I like this idea of having ease on the map. I'm going to definitely have to save this, especially for these uh, mazy bits that are kind of annoying. No, we don't want to fight any of you. We wish to leave. I don't have any desire to fight any of you. There's nothing you can provide me. Only the red beaks. They're the only ones that I need to do anything with. All the rest of you can go eat shit. You're finding loopholes, aren't you? Alright, um... I guess, I guess we'll fight. Might as well, right? Why is my headset so loud? There we go. That's better. Sorry, the game was blaring in my ears. And that's just not on. Yeah, just at attack everybody. We can probably kill these onions before they do anything. Yes, we did kill the onions before they did anything. Good! I am the Slayer of Onions. And I got a red bone. Sweet. I need like eight of those to do anything, but I have one finally. That's good. Weirdly enough, weirdly enough, we actually found our way through this without without the map too, which is even more impressive. I think in um e in Etrian Untold they forego this bullshit floor, and we have other things that go on instead. But there will be awesomeness in here. There truly will. This. This stratum does have a really, really cool, like, last floor, so to speak. Which we're closing in on, actually. We might get there before the end of the day, weirdly enough. A day? Set. Whatever. You know what I mean. If we can tag the next, the next, um, warpy thing... Uh, ge ge geomagnetic pole. That thing. If we can grab the next one of those, that'd be awesome! Because then we could just miss out on all this nonsense. Uh, I have to, unfortunately. I really don't want to burn through this TP, but I really can't afford to take shit tons of damage either. Because I have, like, a healing item that I can use to heal TP. 
and otherwise it's just, uh, yeah. Stalling out relaxing fights and taking 300 years. Alright, um, no, I'm gonna wait till we get to the next thing, which is right through here. Because this is where the game said, hey, there's shit gonna go down. I remember that. Let's go ahead and heal everybody just to top off. We're, we're doing pretty well, I feel. So let's go ahead and pull this E off the map, because it's not what we... Oh, hello. Hmm. Alright then. Hello? Hmm. Well, I guess we're just gonna have to fight it. Ah, good. A hey, Cruella. Cruella. Cruella Deville. I'm not gonna do that. I'm going to. Oh, I can't do anything cool this turn with rain. Okay, never mind then. We'll do that. We'll do that. Yes, that should be fine. Yeah, critical hit. That'll work. Yep. And that is why I didn't want to, uh... Do... Didn't want to, uh, introduce that just yet. I'm gonna have to save up for a, um... A... Relaxing fight. I'm gonna have to. I just, I just need to. I need to use TP to kill these things very quickly. This is two FOEs at once. This is bad news, even for my party of just sheerly awesome people. And the Diablix seems to be the weaker one, but that doesn't mean anything. So let's just try to take them down. I don't really care which one I kill. I just need to kill one of them, and that's not good. Good job, Sony. Kira very well may die from this. Good. Kira has killed herself. Good. Awesome. Well, let's plan to kill them. Let's, uh... Fr Actually, I'm gonna go first anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna go first anyway. So let's Nectar 2 Kira. And then we'll have Sahoni salve, and we'll have Todd do whatever. Good, they got good, they got their turns off. And we didn't kill anyone. That's really not good. <laughs> uh hmm. Um, I guess throw a refresh just because I predict one of them doing something. Oh, good. I love that they're faster than us, by the way, it's the best. But we want... Ooh, we got Oleander. Oh god, Coach Oleander. This is where you've been. Work, work, work must have been hard to find after you've... Now, we could go down. But there's a thing we can do around here somewhere. So this... As you travel through the withered forest, you reach a place with a mysterious aura. Space seems to distort beyond this hole in a tree that's barely wide enough for you. Something unusual is sure to happen if you enter the hole. Enter the hole? Yes. When you open your eyes, you realize that you are standing far from your previous location. Okay, this whole floor's bullshit is over now. We've, uh... We can now circumvent this entire floor by doing that. That's what I wanted to do. Now we can bypass all of this nonsense. And can, and can just continue onward, which is good. And there's stairs down here. Let's be sure to mark that before we continue. Anyway, I'm still going to keep the E's, just so I know how to get through manually if I have to. Gold wings for the pilgrims. All right. And this looks like this. With stairs up. As soon as you step onto the 20th floor, you feel an extremely, you feel extremely strong, feel extremely strong threats from all sides. Have the forest folk finally marshaled their forces against you? As you consider the prospect, the humanoid girl appears once again. Hello. I just, I just want to talk and be. This is gonna sound dumb, but I just want to talk about things. 
The girl makes this harsh demand before spreading her arms and crying out. You are struck by the forest girl's strange words. What does she mean by those that by those that wish but by those that wish for your death? But before you can ask, the girl points to the forest. With that, the girl, the girl disappears before you. You wonder if you should return to town to, or pursue the girl immediately. Well, shit just got serious on this floor. I know what this floor is all about, and indeed shit did just get serious. You'll notice that our random encounter tracker is not actually going up right now. And uh, there's a reason for that. Because this floor doesn't have any random encounters. Not a one. What it does have is a lot of FOEs. Now we need to uh, kill all of the FOEs. As suicidal as that sounds, we need to kill all of them. Because that's part of this area's gimmick. So, uh, yeah. Oh, I need to readjust. Sitting up like this and recording is not for me. What is up? Oh, confusion. That's what. Oh, good. Our healer's been confused. Do we have a, a? Do we have the? Oh, we do. We have everybody on our map. See, there's lots of FOEs on this floor, and we need to go and bother every last one of them. And it's probably going to end very badly for us. But uh, this is how things have to be, unfortunately. Let's just punch KO a couple times, apparently. And I think what's even funnier about this, we actually need to do all of this without leaving the floor. So, uh, this could be potentially a very long encounter. I'm gonna look that up to see if I'm right in my thinking there, but I think we do, in fact, have to kill everybody in one go. And the reason why we have to uh, kill everybody in one go is because uh, the boss will uh, will respawn if memory serves. The boss will respawn until we uh, take out everybody. And all the FOEs are pissed at us now because we've started to f we started to fight one of their friends. All right, good. So there's a path right there. And good. It's one of these diabolixes. That's how it's pronounced, right? I don't care. Uh, let's just attempt. <laughs> let's throw a refresh, just because I'm assuming there's going to be nonsense that happens. Yep, there we go. That's fine. It was only Kira, but still, only Kira is good. Great. I'm glad that she likes to go first. Even before Sahoni, who can fix her. Good. Now, this is incredibly tricky, as you can quite plainly see. Uh, actually, I want him to first turn Sahoni so that we can salve. That's a much smarter plan. Because that way, Kira will not die. No matter what happens, Kira will not die. Todd's been cursed. Screw you, Todd. I hate you. I don't, I don't, I don't actually hate Todd just annoys me. He bothers me. Uh, yeah, we have to take this thing out quick, because there's more friends coming in. Um, uh, I guess I'll just go ahead and salve under the... Actually, boosting is going to be really... is going to be suicidal for Todd, so let's not have him boost. Good! Good, an ogre. This is a new enemy. They're big. Look at him. He is big. Uh... Crap. Yeah, this is, uh... This is not gonna be pleasant for us. Uh... Let's just do that. Hopefully we'll kill her before... Uh, too much happens. Good.
This man is very hard. He has a lot of health. And our buffs just popped off, I think, too. Um, no. Next turn they'll pop off, though. That's not good. Oh, Duke Duke. Things are not going well for Rain in this venture. Imagine how terrifying that- good job. Imagine how terrifying that attack would have been had we not had Defender on. Well, you're going to have to imagine it now, because we don't have Defender on. Uh, we have to first turn Defender. There's no way we can't. There's no way we can get around this. Uh... Yes, we, we need that defense boost. Or we will die. <laughs> That's the only thing we need here, is to die. Um, actually, let me... I hate to... Ugh. Alright, um, I'm gonna go find out if I do need to kill everything or not, because this may change this floor, our approach on this floor if I don't have to kill everything. So, I suppose I'll see you guys in the next part, since it's about the end of the first part, isn't it? So, I'll see you guys in the next part. Okay, um, I learned that I indeed have to kill all of these FOEs without leaving the floor. Um, this is a challenge I don't think my party is fully set up for. I really don't. Um, we're good, but we're not that good. I, still, I'm gonna try and take this guy out, just to say that I did. Uh, but I need to come back to this floor with a renewed strategy. Because, uh, yeah, a strategy is going to have to be put in place for this. Because I'm not going to be able to do that. Uh, I would love to be able to today, but I feel like this is a thing I'm going to have to, uh, have to work on. If we can kill him, I can know that it's a thing I'm capable of. A, oh, okay, can't do that. Okay, um, screw it. Yeah, uh, I honestly don't think I can do this. Um, well, we're gonna we're gonna go and do another thing. Actually, we're not gonna go do another thing. We're gonna basically attempt to kill this thing. Okay, defender hasn't fallen off yet, but we need to kill him this turn, or else he gets a friend. Which is going to be something we cannot handle. Good. Oh, good. Hunter. Sweet. Let's leave. We, we have to flee. Like bitches, we have to flee. Thank you, Todd. Yeah, we, we, have, we have to go. We have to leave. We, we cannot do this. Uh... I hate having to do that. Um... Well, I guess I'm gonna have to, um... Damn it! Uh... Hmm, Rose Ring. I don't know, wonder what that does. Well, let's figure out what that does, I suppose. Eh, I guess. It's not that bad, I suppose. Well, we're, we're gonna lick our wounds, we're gonna heal, um... Damn it! Alright. Because, yeah, all those FOEs are back now, by the way. The the one that we killed, uh, she's back. So, yeah, um, I guess I'm gonna go grind. I guess, for who the hell knows how long. Um, yeah, that that's a thing I have to do. Um, sorry to cut this week short. I might throw up a, vid of, a video of something else to compensate for not making really any progress this time. Um, I might map out this floor just so I know how it looks, so I can kind of identify choke points, and you're gonna have to pardon me on, the, on doing that. Because this is war. This is war, soldier. We found Oleander, and it's war. Who would've known? Um, I'm gonna stock up on just a shit ton of healing items. like. A shit ton of healing items. 
And I'll look into if just leaving the floor and going back to this, going back to that, um, that spring, the, uh, water on the, what floor is that? I think it's 18th. It's one where there's the water. Yeah, 18th. If we can go back here and get that and then go back, if I can do that, I might be able to. I don't know. I don't know the rules of this. As long as you, like, I know what I just did. All the FOEs are back. I know that. So I guess I'm going to look more into this. Um, this is a genuine stumbling block here. Um, but I'm going to do that between videos. Um, yeah, so I guess I'll put, I'll put up something else to, in addition to this. And then next time we're going to go be in war, I guess. <laughs> war against all of the forest folk. That sounds fair. So, um, we're gonna have really good gear, we're gonna have the best gear I can manage, we're gonna have the best, the best of everything that I can give my party, we're gonna have. Maybe a couple extra levels under our belt, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just gonna throw things at a board until it works, cause god, those ogres are hard. Uh, there's a lot of things that's hard going on in this floor, and I don't like it. But this, I do this kind of thing would happen, where there's going to be a moment where we, where we just don't make progress. So, that's why it's only once a week. Hey! So, I'm going to grind for a while. I don't know how long, but for a while. We're going to, we're going to do stuff. We're going to, we're going to, we're going to fight. We're going to, we're going to do things next time. I know, I'm copping out insanely, and I'm sorry. But... Yeah, the odds are against us, guys. So next time, we're going to continue on the 20th floor. We're going to fight in war, apparently. And I'm going to be stronger in the next in the next video. So see you guys then. Until then, till then. Rain K, out.